President Joe Biden announced on Thursday that states should provide each person $100 if they are fully vaccinated against the COVID-19 virus. The president stated that the funds available to states would come from the federal government's state recovery funds. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis, on the other hand, is urging caution. It's not as simple as handing over the cash. DeSantis, according to a spokesperson for the governor, will be unable to accept money from the SRF without the consent of the state legislature. The governor's office said, the utilization of the COVID-19 relief fund for the fiscal year 2021-2022 has already been outlined in Section 152 of the General Appropriations Act. As a result, there is no money available in Florida for such an incentive this year. Biden's latest plan to increase lagging vaccination rates in many parts of the country included a monetary incentive as one of its ideas. The crux of his new plan, which he unveiled on Thursday afternoon, is a need for federal employees to inform their employers about their immunization status or face stringent limits. Biden is also instructing the Defense Department to investigate adding the COVID-19 vaccine to the list of mandatory immunizations for military personnel. He's also asked his team to take efforts to ensure that all federal contractors are subject to the same criteria. Several states have offered monetary incentives to residents to be vaccinated. New Mexico, Ohio, and Colorado tried out the idea, and New York Governor Andrew Cuomo announced a $100 reward for New Yorkers on Wednesday, similar to Biden's plan.